เริ่มของเธอเลยเฮ้ยเพื่อนส์ I hope you all doing great how was you and welcome to the series where I'm answering the first ten questions from Project a l l and it's probably the ninth one the question here is the question a Pythagorean triplet is a set of three natural numbers a b and c whereas a less than b and b less than c for which A square plus B square is equal to C square. As an example, three square plus four square that is is equal to twenty five. That means five square. There exists exactly one Pythagorean triplet for which A plus A square, no, A plus B plus C is equal to one thousand. Okay, so we have to find that exact one set of A plus B, A B and C. So that the sum of a plus b and a plus b plus c will be one thousand exact. So here is the program for that. And okay, let me make it big for to understand. Okay, here is the question. As you know, I am answering the questions by C language. You can answer it. By any other language, also. So here's the header, header files. Then main, int main. Oh, forget about this printf here. Hello world. And here are the variables a, b, and c, and a flag variable to count something in a loop, and a result that I. Give the value as zero first, and set a is equal to one, b is equal to two, and c is equal to three, because at least the because a is the shortest one, a is the smallest one here, so the lowest value we can give a is one. Maybe you are thinking that lowest value can be zero also, but. That's not possible because if a is zero, then b and c will be equal, and that's not what we want here because a b should be less than c, not less than equal to c. Okay, I hope you got it. Then just I use three while loops to control a, b, and c. Okay, and c. The first for loop is the condition is c less than nine ninety seven. Okay, because the first at because all right now c has the value of three, so just minus thousand minus three here, and flag is equal to is equal to one. Because after getting the answer, we will change the flag as zero here. So it's just checking have we got the answer or not. That's why we just put it here and flag is equal to zero to one. Then b is equal to zero. We don't need it here. Maybe no, we need it here. Then ah uh, another for while loop. You can use for loop as well. And here b less than c and flag is equal to equal to zero again. And uh, a is equal to one. Then a uh, while loop that this is the final one where a less than b and flag is equal to equal to one. Then a uh, if condition to to check the answers or uh, like as the equation a square plus b square is equal to c square if it satisfies that. And we also have to see that. The sum of a and b and c should be one thousand. So here is the condition for that. Then the we need the answer as the product to find the product of product a b c. So here we are counting that a b a into b into c, and we are storing that into result variable. And and I just put a printf here. So that we I can understand what the values of 
a b and c and calculate that maybe in calculator and then make if make that flag zero then after the while loop a plus plus then b plus plus then c plus plus then a printer here to print the result and then return that's it nothing much and let me copy it for you control c and open our exist project tutorial and control a delete control v that's it let's check is there any mistake or not no so here is the answer three one eight seven five triple zero thank you for watching and you can calculate that by calculator here and the values of a b and c is as follows to 200 and 357 then 500 25 okay that's it thank you for watching